Hey everybody, this is PJ Riley from Lancaster Archery here in our distribution warehouse today. PSE has just launched a bunch of its 2018 bows and we've got two of them here that we're excited about that we wanted to tell you all about. Uh, we're going to start off with the PSE Expedite. This is a flagship hunting bow from PSE that just has a ton of great features. Um, not the least of which, the one that's going to grab you right off the bat is this right here, five and a quarter inch brace height. This is a speed bow, 360 feet per second max. Uh, just an awesome bow, lots of speed. And we don't want to scare you off with five and a quarter inch brace because it features the PSE Evolve Cam, which they came out with last year. And so that's going to take out a lot of the negative things that usually come with a five inch brace height. Um, it's real smooth to draw because of the Evolve Cam. Uh, just rolls over nice. You don't really feel the weight. And this bow, the Evolve Cam, you can get three different mods. Uh, and that's designed to give you three different performances. So you've got a high let off mod is what's going to come from the factory with this bow. That features 80 or 90% let off. You can adjust between the two. And you can imagine 90% let off. Once you get this thing back to full draw, it's like holding nothing. Uh, just really nice. Um, then they have what they call a low let off fast mod. So that one's going to feature 65 and 75% let off, but it's going to have a shallow valley. That's the mod you're going to need to get that 360 feet per second. Third, you're going to have just a regular low let off mod. Uh, this is going to be one that people uh, like 3D archers are going to like that. 65 and 75% uh, let off with a regular valley. So it's not going to be as sharp or aggressive as the fast mod. Um, so as you said, it comes with the 80-90% let off, but then you can switch uh, to whatever you want uh, after that. And speaking of the mod, it uh, features um, 24 and a half to 30 inch draw lengths, um, half inch increments in between there. It's just a rotating mod. Just loosen the screws and you change it to set to your draw length. One of the things those of you who work on your own bows are going to like is the, the cable stop which stops the cam from rotating is built into the draw length mod. So you don't have to do two different things. You don't have to change the draw length and then change the uh, draw stop. It's all one piece. So that's really nice. Um, as we mentioned with the Evolve cam that came out last year. So it's a big cam as you can see, uh, which sometimes you would think might lead to problems with cam lean. But with the Evolve Cam, one of the unique features about it is it's got this string take up right here. It takes up the uh, cable that's a, the cable harness um, and it does a full wrap around the string take up inside each side of the cam. And what that does then is that's going to hold it steady so that you don't have to worry about cam lean. So this completely unravels when you go through the draw cycle and it completely takes it back up uh, as the bow comes forward. Uh, incidentally, it's 33 inches axle to axle. That's a nice uh, length for a bow. You've got uh, dual cages below the handle and above the handle. That's going to make this bow very stiff and rigid. Five and a quarter inch brace height, you'd expect a lot of hand shock. You don't get that with this bow. Something PSE has been doing for a while now. They've got their new wedge lock system for their limbs. That makes sure that their limbs are locked into place. You don't have to worry about any kind of lateral movement. No slop in the, in the limbs there. So uh, this bow is available in maximum draw weights of 60, 65, and 70 pounds. Um, something, a uh, cool feature of all the PSE bows this year is PSE is now making their own strings. Uh, they have a new system called the live wire system for making their strings and cables. And basically what they wanted to do was eliminate rotation. Uh, so they pre-stretch this material here, incidentally, it's a BCY 452X string material. That's kind of the industry standard for high-end uh, bow strings and cables. 
and they pre-stretch it so when you, the consumer, get it on your bow, you're not gonna have to worry about peep rotation. So just high quality strings and cables that now PSE is making in-house. So next up, we have the PSE React. Uh, this is a great new bow that's out this year and what's great about it is it's a mid-range bow. It's not priced like your high-end flagships, but it features the Evolve Cam. This is the cam that PSE has on all of its high-end bows, so you can pay a, a little bit lower price, but still get the high-performance cam that it has on its best bows. This bow comes with uh, the mod that allows for 80 or 90% let off. 90% let off, you're basically holding almost nothing at full draw. It's real nice, you can hold it all day. Um, the React you're gonna see has a seven inch brace height, which is very forgiving. That combined with the Evolve Cam, you got a super forgiving bow for drawing and it's a nice, easy draw cycle. So this bow is rated at 330 feet per second IBO. It comes in maximum draw weights of 60 and 70 pounds. The draw length is another rotating mod uh, and it offers 26 to 31 and a half inches, half inch increments. You just turn the mod to get it to the draw length that you want. As always, if you have any questions, be sure and visit us at LancasterArchery.com.